Father Seth here for some Wednesday Wisdom for Wednesday, March 22nd, 2023. Lent is flying by. Easter is almost upon us. We still have a few weeks left, though, so there's still some great opportunities here at St. Rose and Our Lady of Mount Carmel to participate in the Lenten festivities. Again, Monday night, the light is on for you from 5.30 till 7 at St. Rose for confessions. Also, along with confessions, there's adoration of the Blessed Sacrament and benediction at 7 p.m. It's a time to quiet our hearts and spend some time with our Lord uh, in the Blessed Sacrament, uh, exposed on the altar in adoration. Uh, it's a great experience of God's mercy as well. So uh, if you have some time to stop in, you don't have to stay the whole time, but please uh, know that you're, everyone is most welcome. Stations of the Cross are once uh, continuing on Fridays after the 8 a.m. Mass at St. Rose and 6 p.m. at Our Lady of Mount Carmel. Uh, there is no book club tonight. Father Mosley has uh, a meeting for the St. Joseph Center, so he will not be able to be at uh, There is No Book Club. Just a reminder that the Knights of Columbus are having their clam chowder and cabbage and noodle cell on Fridays. Uh, more information is in the bulletin. Also, uh, some delectable delights. The Our Lady of Mount Carmel Altar Rosary Easter Bread Sale is next week. Um, more information, again, is in the bulletin on that. Also in the bulletin, a lot of good stuff in there this week, I tell you. May, you definitely should read it. Uh, the Easter schedule for the Easter services, for the Triduum and for uh, Easter Sunday. Uh, all the Holy Week festivities are in the bulletin, so please consult the bulletin. Uh, you know, if I start reading, trying to read uh, t dates and times, I'm just going to get messed up. So just consult the bulletin, uh, and the schedule will be online uh, on Facebook uh, shortly. Just a big uh, thank you for all of those who have uh, participated in the Building Disciples Sharing Love Stewardship Program. Uh, it's a great opportunity if you haven't participated uh, and didn't get a card, please stop by the office or you can pick one up at any of the doors of the church, uh, at all of the churches. Um, it's an opportunity, first and foremost, to share the gifts that God has given us, both time, talent, and treasure. So uh, as we move forward, there'll be some great opportunities uh, to get involved uh, with your talent and time. Um, your treasure... It is important. It helps us to run things, as, as you know, as I as I said, and as we know. But again, it's a great opportunity to get involved and share the gifts of God with us. Also important with that uh, commitment card uh, is helping us uh, to update our records so that we have proper phone numbers and email addresses so that we can better communicate with you moving forward in the future as new events are coming forward um, and different programs are happening here at St. Rose and Our Lady of Mount Carmel. And there's also online giving available for both parishes. So there's more information on our website, 3 is one catholicscom um, Please consult the bulletin for the uh, how you can do it. And uh, the website, the setup is very easy for the online giving. So both parishes have the online giving now. Um, we made those steps to make it available to uh, both parishes. Uh, so it's, again, a great opportunity and easy so that you don't have to be carrying uh, cash. Um, I know our new world, we don't carry cash so much. Everything's done electronically. So trying to make it as easy as possible for you. So once again, thank you for your commitment. If you haven't returned your cards, please uh, do so. Um, it's a great opportunity, again, to participate in this program, and we look uh, to these new programs that will be coming over the next months and years uh, because of your generosity and your help. So again, thank you for participating, and I just invite you to continue to open your heart to know God's love and mercy. As we uh, continue our journey of Lent, we know that Lazarus is arrives this weekend uh, for in the gospel and we look to that new life that comes from God how he does raise us up uh, from the dead from the dead of sin of the of doubt and he is there to help us to give us new life so may we know God's grace and mercy and may we continue to walk this Lenten journey with him leading up to the great celebration of Easter have a great day everyone God bless